Hello there, Terry here. I am currently, currently in the middle of recording a TR3 speed, not speedrun, TR3 Let's Play. I am caught in the RX Tech, RX Tech Mines, and it has been driving me mad. So, first, I don't have any FMVs. And so much for speed running this. Um, so the deal is, is that tier 3 has been driving me mad, because I don't remember Antarctica for anything. Wow. How the hell did I do that? So, I don't remember the Antarctica section for anything, just because... Oh, right, I have to deal with that, won't I? Um, remember them for anything, so I went through the RX Tech Mines, through the first part of it, and completely missed a drop I'm supposed to get. <sighs> Shoot, Laura, you're an idiot. Um, so, here I am sitting bored in the middle of summer, you know, like usual, and I'm like, hmm, my Let's Plays have gotten a little better as far as commentary goes. You know, <laughs> doing Let's Plays at 2 a.m. does not a good commentary make. Whoa, almost had it. Um, so, I have done what I call a quick run of this level. Which is to say, oh, she's going to hit the ground. <laughs> which is to say <laughs> that, um... It's not fast enough to be called a speed run, but it's fast, you know. Like, you're trying to do it as quickly as possible, but you're not being a complete... Oh my goodness, Laura. Okay. Step back. <laughs> Basically, you're trying to do it fast, but you're not being a perfectionist about it. Okay, that's good enough. Um... And this level has been crazily abused. Okay. Uh, I technically think that's not the quickest way to do it, but whatever. Yes, and let's watch me get blindsided by a tiger. Again. Not this time, kitty. Alright. So, TR3 is driving me mad. Um. Jeez. And, uh, I was looking on YouTube, and I'm like, Oh, right, FML Crispy Laura. I wonder what she's up to. Apparently she was doing a non-Tomb Raider game, of which I did not really look into, but I saw that she had done the Floating Islands Tier 2, and I'm just like, ah, oh, Tier 2 is such a better game. Tier 2 is one of those games I just know. So I thought I'd do a, not a quick run, but a, let's see how well Terra remembers everything. I mean, Terra. Yeah, that's how I like Terra, right? Yes, my name has changed. Uh, <laughs> it's because I, f I fear modern society. And whatnot. Okay. Spiders are nothing to be trifled with, I guess. And no, that wasn't enough of a ledge for me to more in it. So, the goal of this is uh, to not be eaten by spiders, because, wow, these actually do take quite a bit of health. Um, the goal, as it were, is to beat this in A, as few segments as possible, i.e. as quickly as possible, and B, um, mm -hmm. as few deaths as possible. Um, My uh, criteria on that is not set yet. Oh. Oh, whatever. They're just flying this. They won't kill me. Oh, they could. Oh, they won't now. Alright, so. My criteria is, if I'm trying something for fun, it doesn't count. 
So let's see if I can't repeat that boulder trick. Oh no! Huh, she's still not dead. Yet. Okay, so I have to be quick on this bit. Ah! Sidesip button, sidesip button! Laura! Laura! Oh, 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 oh! Oh, almost. <laughs> Darn it. Alright, screw the boulder thing, let's do this quicker. So yes, Tomb Raider 2 is probably one game out of the, the five, the five that matter anyway, that I know. Also, TR2 has a really bad control scheme, and she's going to get impaled. Her magnum clip's really worth it. Nah, I just use the pistols anyway. Alright, not worth it, not worth it. I mean, it's totally possible, but... <laughs> oh, wow, that worked a lot better than I thought it would. Grab it, grab it, grab it! Run, you crazy! Whew! Jeez. <sighs> well, I'm gonna need all the medi packs. Also, I dislike my habit of going dead silent whenever I'm doing crazy stuff. But, I mean, I think you can forgive me for that. <laughs> Alright, so do we want to go see Mr. and Mrs. Dinosaur? I want the grenade launcher for Venice. It's more like, do I want the grenades for Venice? Probably won't use the grenade launcher at all in Venice. Alright, yeah. Summon all the spiders, get all the spiders dead so they don't kill me in the meantime. Alright. Let's go and see Mr. and Mrs. Dinosaur, if I can remember how to do this. <laughs> it's probably something like that. I always just rough it. Who cares? Next. <laughs> Damn it. All right. A little more to the right. Hey, at least she landed correctly. <laughs> oh my goodness. Like, the angle has on this has to be pretty darn good. And... Wow, I can't do it. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Oh, she must have hit the... Either it's part of the roll. Oh, it must be the roll. Okay, so let's stop rolling. <laughs> and just dive. I'm hitting the block. Or something. You know what? I don't care. <laughs> we forsake the magnum clips, we forsake the grenades. Well, I could go down there. It's just take me for bloody ever. Also, why isn't sidestep on shift left, shift right? If anyone's watching this and knows how to set it up in TR2, let me know. Because I've grown used to it. I'll give TR3 that much. Wow, the tiger was all the way in here? No, please don't cut me. Please don't cut me. Please don't cut me. Thank you. Ha 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 ha. Oh, this is loud. <laughs> Pardon me, if that was just your way of trying the doors for me. <laughs> With a tommy gun on my keyring. Though not anymore. So after you. Somehow, you, you don't, don't behave, behave like, like you, you got, got the monk's blood. blood. 
I understand that somehow is in my favor. So indulge me about the dagger. I'd be indebted with your life. These doors are waiting for the right one. The right time to arrive. And then the dagger's blade will honor the hearts of those who believe. So unless you pledge your loyalty as well. And which one is that? To the sins and fortunes of Marco Bartoli. I hope you remember what he said, because I do. Perhaps not just yet, then. Aha. Uh -huh. Gianni Bartelli. Via Caravelli, Venice. So, um, I forget his name, CJ06, maybe? I don't know, he does talk-throughs for the, he has talk-throughs for 1, 2, 3, and 4, and apparently he's working on, or has completed, I don't know, talk-through 5. They're hilarious. Question he raises, why didn't you just, like, you know, blow it up, put a can of baked beans in the hole? You know, do you really need this single device? Whatever. Onward! Just because we're doing this quickly. Oh, come on, Dougie. Come on, Dougie. Yeah, that's right. Day Dougie. Okay, that guy didn't spawn yet. This one sure as hell is there. As always with these games, once you know what you're doing, there's a dog. Next comes a big thug. Just a big thug like every other big thug. Thuggy 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 thug thug. Thuggy thug thug. thug, thug. Oh. You're dead. Uh -huh. Hey, bright news. Huh? <laughs> bright news? Um. Wait. Right, I think. Oops. Oh, huh, that's an easier thing. Wait, how do I get up there quickly again? It's not this, is it? Oh, it is. Haha! <laughs> I knew I had some trick. Come on. You see, I'm saving less often because I know what the heck I'm doing. <laughs> Alright, let me think. Secrets. Uh, the gold is there. The bronze, that's there. And the jade is up there. Okay. We're good. We're gonna get all the secrets in this level just because I know them all. Good news, I know this level. Eaten by shark. Seriously, what is it with, um, 40 fathoms? I had labeled the video shark, uh, tagged it shark, and everyone and their mother wants to watch it. Actually, I hope people's mothers aren't watching this. Wait, stones are over here. Um, flare, flare, okay. Flare is currently the TR3 sprint button. Duly noted. I'm like, I don't think there were rats here, but. Must be down there. Anyway. Come here, Flare. We're going on an adventure! Going on an adventure! Okay, I can't say that. I'm technically breaking copyright of some kind. It's a magical Neoplurodon, Lara Croft. Anyway. And waterfall. Out of the jello we go. Anyway. Um, 
Now that's a really tricky secret. Like, that's just kind of evil. Wait, are there bubbles in TR3? <laughs> Seriously, people, this is important. And I can't see it. Damn thing. There's some clips down here, or flares, or something, maybe? No? Alright, um... <laughs> Jeez, Laura. Okay, I think so long as I don't break into there, nothing will happen. I was saying? this level. Do you all remember when I tried to do it blind? I was driving a boat around the whole bloody map for a good 50 minutes? So I must say this is a good puzzle. Um, generally, if you're playing, you need two speed boats. Um, you can get one speed boat um, from place the first part of the level where I was um, and then you need to bring it here put it in this dock raise it to this level don't shoot me um, oh I know where I am can I go through there or is that like blocked off that is blocked off, so we're going this way. Actually, pull it for air, because I'm expecting baddies up here. So you bring the boat over here. The reason why you need two boats is at the end, uh, guarding the door to the next level is a bunch of uh, sea mines. Fun stuff. Um, so generally what you would ideally do though. I don't know what, why they think you'd be forced to take boats into there. Oh my god, I forgot about you. I also don't know what the control scheme is right now, as far as mini packs go. Why are they masked, anyway? It's like, there's no one out here on the wonderful Venetian streets. Hey, wait, what? Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm like, wait, the doors aren't opening? <laughs> we have a problem here. So, the door is set on a timer. The timer's trigger is that. So you're supposed to drive the boat in and then race to the door. Oh, that's how they get you with the boat. Okay, I get it now. But you can bypass that trigger by going under the door you used to enter. <laughs> And by passing the timer trigger, because it doesn't start until you do the trigger, you can take all your leisurely time to swim straight up to the door, and then magically appear with the boat. It's actually a pretty good, pretty well designed level. Pretty good design level. Yes, my English has deteriorated. Thanks for noticing. Uh, is there any point? In Okay. I'll take that as a no. Oh, Christ. Um. Laura. I thought you can get through here. Maybe not. Oh, there we go. Don't shoot me. No. Actually. Here, I do have one question. What if I were to swim into the mines? I don't think I've ever tried that, actually. No. No, it just must be a boat trigger of some kind. But yeah, you, you're you supposed to sacrifice one boat by running it towards the mines and then jumping out. It's actually pretty cool.
man. I don't know why they give me a boat <laughs> when I came in on Merlegs. Wait, how do I get out? Oh. <sighs> so let it be known that I'm just a big thug, just like every other big thug. Thugga thugga. I'm wearing a baseball cap with the Phenomenera on it. What? Why? <laughs> did did Bartoli get those especially made? <laughs> Alright, I want all my... I'm, I'm sorry, I can't do an Italian accent. I want all my thugs. Sorry, the word thug just comes out in that voice. Um... Ah! Um, yeah, that was for the rats that's floating midair, not for the rat that appeared out of nowhere and scared me. It didn't scare me. Oh, I thought there were flares here. Oh, wait, that was the demo. Eh, never mind. Or the beta. And I should have some new thug running at me. And another one of those Fina Manera baseball caps. With the mini pack, uh -huh. thank you. And shortcut tricks. You see, I'm I'm doing this like just spontaneously, so I'm trying to remember what tricks I can do. I don't think there's. Yeah. The guy up there on the ledge, can we? Jeez, this game is unforgiving. I, I honestly think that um, you can't really evade bullets in this one. Like it's just a target and hit kind of thing. Oh no, the dogs! No, no, no. Oh wait, it's not sharks. Who cares? As I was saying, <laughs> these are the Maggies. Yeah. So, as I noted once before, uh, when I played this before, you used to be seams that you could easily see here in these gates, and you could roll right through them, essentially bypassing like two-thirds of the bloody level. And you know, that would be awesome right now. But, um, for the moment, just because I think the dude up there dropped something that I am going to want. Me being the scavenging little Laura that I am. If that made sense to you, then all the better, I guess. Ugh, yes, push that block. Can't wait to get on that cruise liner with all the iron on it. Okay, I kind of watched some of my videos. <laughs> and this is a lucky grab. Anyway. <laughs> oh, luckily... <laughs> Breaking the laws of physics, kind of grab. Let's see if I can do this. Nope. But mommy, mommy, I don't want to climb ladders. Okay, gets a will. It just mirrors her shotgun breaking into her arm. Good job, Laura. You have shotgun arm now. Alright, so there's a dude on the right. I could have used the wall in bed. That was a trick. That was a trick. 
No, wait. I, can I do that? Or is that the beta again? Oh, for goodness sakes. I need to just get out of these levels. Wait. If I'm just gonna go blind running into this... Oh, I'm running out of safe space. Oh, whatever. <laughs> I did a sound check. <laughs> Everything should be okay. And... Haha. <laughs> No, to get raped by two dogs and a thug. Come back here. I'm just gonna have to chase you down. Wow, perfect engagement. No item. Okay. Now for one secret. And I almost loaded that game, which would have been horrible. Given just how well that little engagement with two dogs and a thug went. And how bad this one's gonna go. Never mind, that went pretty okay too. Huh. I have better skills. Take that, FML Crispy Laura. Um, no. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> now, one of the things she says, and it is true, um, is to never show off, never try and do tricks, never like, you know, I can totally do this. I know this. Oh shit, I know this level eaten by shark. Ugh. Hubris is the death of Laura, if that's the proper word. Oh my goodness, this guy is quick turn. Uh -huh. Hey, wait a sec. The deck key. If this works, I'm just gonna take it because these aren't supposed to be long. There you go. I'm gonna need a medipack. Okay, apparently zero is a flare. Nine is a full. Duly noted. Thank god I'm gonna need a full. Right time to arrive. And then the dagger's blade will honor the hearts of those who believe. So unless you pledge your loyalty as well, to which one is that? To the sins and fortunes of... I'm sorry, who? I need to look him up on a computer. No. Okay. So now we have the detonator key. We just skipped a really good chunk of the level. And there's going to be more gun-toting thugs right behind this door. If <laughs> Laura could get into the square to unlock it. Okay, that was one of my bullets. Uh -huh. Alright. So... I think that door opens. I don't want it to open right now. If it doesn't open, then we're screwed. <laughs> so, who would have think? Who, who would have thunk it? It came to mind, but I wasn't going to say it. So, who would think that these were scalable? <laughs> Every time I did it, I'd be confused out of my mind. Actually, I don't know why I'm doing this. This is for Uzis. <laughs> Wait. Oh, I'm missing secrets by doing this. No, wait. What did I get? I got the stone. Where's the gold? Oh, it's under that thing.
Okay, so we'll probably miss the gold dragon then. The Laura, <laughs> Laura, <laughs> you, 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 you're drunk, Laura. Okay. So yeah, I probably could have just corner glitched onto this wall I'm about to try and get onto, but hey, whatever. Alright. There's a reason why this is slightly raised, and that's slightly lowered. Would you like to know what the reason is? If you don't know already, you should go watch my other videos, just to make them feel better. <laughs> Actually, what is the current running time of this video, anyway? Hopefully, I can do like three... No, I could probably do Opera House at the same time. Though I don't want to be a turret with boobs. That's all Laura is, a turret with boobs. Now I have Uzis! Okay. <sighs> oh, but Opera House. That takes a lot of... I mean, it's not terribly hard to do. You can be done in, like, three minutes if you do it correct, but it just takes so much finicky effort. Oh, my God, Laura. Uh, you just... Well, do your arms just fail you, or... Do you think of pies and then, like, just think, oh, yay, pies, and raise your arms in the air or something? I don't know. Okay. So these doors should just open, and I can't backtrack to there. Oh, I don't want to go in there. I can't go through that door, because that's where I w should come from. Okay, fun battle time. The jump and roll is the best tactic I've ever seen for human enemies. Especially those heavily armed with silenced pistols. Dudes, no one's out here. No one is out here. You have nothing to fear. Alright, let's see if I can do this. Yeah! Alright. So to simplify things, um, actually... I don't even need to set out the detonator and risk my life with a gun-toting idiot up there. So, let's just get that Jade Secret for the whole, you know, helping my secret count. And then we'll just do the uh -huh. control grab jump thing. Oh my god, that wall thing just saved me. Alright. Go, Laura. You can't jump and do it. If you hold control and do it, you can do it. Yeah! Okay, this is where shit gets serious. No, I refuse to let you shoot me. Ha! Huh. Wow! Huh, that's actually a pretty good camera setup. So I just want to say, it's kind of amazing um, what muscle memory... I mean, it's like what you can remember over time. Like, seriously. I didn't do that efficiently. Frankly, I don't think much of anyone could. Um, let's see. If I jump, and ah, oh, this music! I hate it. Just thug, die, get on the floor, and be dead. Uh -huh. Comes another thug. Club wielding. That trigger. 
<laughs> oh, I can't backflip in those spaces. Okay. Cool. Can't shoot this. Da na na na. Na na na. Can't shoot this. Da na na. So here comes the tricky bit. I remember this being the difficult bit on the other run too. I'm gonna do this while I'm not getting shot to death. Well, I guess we we'll just have to deal with using a mini pack. Right, there's the first part of the level completely bloody done. There's a shortcut where you can jump on this little like roof thing over here from the roof over there. I think I tried doing that once. I probably spent a good 30 minutes trying to do that. <laughs> you corner glitch from the entrance up to the roof thing there, and you come across over here and you jump there on the f on the flat stuff. Yeah, with the key, of course. Well, not necessarily with the key. Uh, someone was able to, like, run Ram Laura through the door. I forget who. All you speedrunners are awesome. Oh, oh. Okay, let's play a game. Sorry, I know I'm trying to be quick and all this, but let's play the... Um, fall with the wood game. Let me look. This, let me scout this out a second. Okay, I got it. I got it. <laughs> Whoops. Well, I think you get the point. <laughs> the point is you run across and back, breaking all the wooden tiles you can to the point where you can't go the whole way. It's kind of fun. All right. Do I fight all these thugs and dogs and whatnot? Or do I try and find the gold dragon place and skip it? I think we'll fight. I have the superior high ground. I'd just like to say that the camera in this game is a lot kinder than the one in TR3. They're not killing me this time. After the dogs. Do one circuit. Check for any other thugs and dogs. Enai. Okay. Pick up the ammo. Because we'll need the ammo for whenever we get the guns again. Mm -hmm. See, this is why I didn't really care about the Magnum stuff. Because A, I'm not killing that much. B. Ah. Where have you been all my life? B. I'm just gonna lose the guns later. <laughs> yeah, offshore rig is gonna be a pretty long section. Actually, it's just two levels, right? That could probably be its own like segment thing, and I'm just going wrong the wrong way because you're the thug I want to find. So, note for the carrying. You're supposed to go up in there, pull a switch, open this. This opens the booth to the opera house. 
And is this that's no, not B spikes. Are these shards of glass? This is the booth, you get in the booth, you do some things, you gain access, you do a bunch of other things. There's where we're wanting. We want those Uzi clips. Well, not them specifically, but... And we'll save, because I get the feeling she's going to impale herself on a bunch of glass. Nope, I'm just that good. And she's horrible. Sorry, I want to do this. What do you mean I'm horrible? Laura, look, 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 you just died. No. <laughs> anyway. What Laura should be doing is walking very slowly and carefully through very sharp and very painful shards of glass. ka -ching. Alright. Alternatively, from the booth, you could just take this golden secret thing and... Actually, I don't know how to get here. <laughs> Legitimately. <laughs> I mean, I don't know how to get to the gold secret, legitimately. I know how to get here, legitimately. Also, this is a horrible design flaw. And that was a horrible jump. Uh. Wow. Man, I can't do that. Alright, let's take a little bit more time. Line this stuff up. No! What the heck? This is so easy, why can't I do it? It is... It is FML Crispy Laura. It is as she said, she is the prophet. She is... I'm sorry for that voice. Um... Huh? Okay. Okay, we're good. <laughs> I'm like, I know where that is, and it leads to thugs. <laughs> okay. Welcome to Thugland. The trigger for the swinging thing has not been set off. Which makes my life just the tiniest bit easier. Okay. So. I think what we're going to try and do... is to not get mauled by boxes. <laughs> also, not to get raped by Mr. Double Guns. Or dogs, or thugs, oh my god. <laughs> Side step, side step, side step, and swing back. <laughs> okay, side step, side step, side step, swing forward. Don't shoot her, don't shoot her, don't shoot her. Thank you. Alright, that opens the plane bay doors. And now, what's my health? Crap, okay. Let's see if we can get out of here. No. <laughs> Apparently not. Wait. Jeez. Let's just take this piece at a time. Okay. I should have used a flare. Damn it. They're just gonna take him, who cares? At least I think they'll take him. All right. Yes, Venice done.
but it's not quite the same now, is it? Someday you will get a speeding ticket for the tongue, Fabio. Hey, it's just a gut feeling that um, maybe you are wrong to look there. Is your belief so fragile? Relax. Breathe deep. The gut, Fabio. It's no more direction than a simple through and out. Honest. greater than impulse. He possessed the seraph. But he was just a disciple in this design. His death, plotting a path to be sought by the one, his son. You understand? Have faith, Fabio. Not God, Rod. We are searching the right place. I know it. I believe it, Marco. Good. Heroes, have you... Fixed that rail yet. See. See. Yes, we are going to see. Thanks for asking. So where did the wrench toting thug come from? Is there just like some secret compartment in the back behind the boxes Laura was doing? Was he just like, you know, off in the corner? Jerking off? I don't know. Alright, so I'll do this again because I don't have full motion video. I want you to imagine yourself on this seaplane. It is pulling in and pulling into an offshore rig. Now we're in an offshore rig. Music in this game is awesome. Oh, they didn't take him. Oh, whatever. Okay. Welcome to Offshore Rig, the worst level ever designed. And no, I'm not continuing this with this right now. We're just going to do these in sections, not levels, sections. But for the moment. We need to do the customary let's kill Laura. And. Man, I'm not good at this. You're supposed to pull the blocks around and make a fun path. Hmm. How should we kill her? Well, the barrels are too easy, you know. Oh my god, he has an assault rifle. Um. And I can't break these. Whoops. Well, now I'm in the water. <sighs> that leaves us with... Well, really only two options. Death? Oh. Ooh, shiny thing. Ooh, I want the Jade Dragon of Shininess. Blah, 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 blah. You know, she always deserves it. Hey, that was quick, right? Yay, my frustration's gone! <laughs> Not really. Uh...